trend actually started in 2015, uh, July, when the uh, Vietnam government allows uh, foreign investors to 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 buy real estate in residential. Basically, they, they allow uh, overseas investors to buy uh, residential projects in Vietnam. So uh, that's uh, so th- that's where the trend started, and and actually that the time uh, where the the key cities like Ho Chi Minh City, like Hanoi, they went up a lot. So, right uh, during the time, actually Ho Chi Minh went up a lot. So, uh, in D1, D2, uh, D1, D7, and, and and that kind of area, they went up a lot. And in the past uh, one one year, due to the trade war between Hong Kong and U, uh, between China and uh, US, uh, there's a lot of um, uh, manufacturers going to uh, Vietnam to set up uh, industrial plants and stuff like that and they, they there's a strong demand for living uh, especially in northern Vietnam say Hanoi and Hoi Phong and, and that kind of area um, so that drive another wave of um, uh, demand for uh, investment uh, in Hanoi. So uh, and recently, uh, we we as we are starting to we, we are starting our seminars in Hong Kong on our Vietnam projects. We see a lot of people uh, realize the fact that they control the COVID nineteen pandemic uh, very well in Vietnam. Mm. So they see they, they, they have a more they, they develop their confidence on on uh, on uh, investing in Vietnam as well. Yeah, mm, I see. 